nafeel po ju na jua ni holiday na kila mtu anahitaji rest so it's important kwa mwili wa mchezaji to find rest then to recharge na kurudi tena next season I pick up my zoezi because anything can happen in football. So you can never rest and you don't know what is next. You can rest, you to zero than when you were before. So see poor Pia Kuretsana and Papia, you keep, keep fit for your body shape. Yeah, I think it's the best season because if you look at the previous one, nilikuwa na injury na nilikuwa nimevunjika mguu so i had to work hard to be what i am today so it was difficult but it was a long process but with patience and believing in god it was successful ah uh, can you find a different is like nilikuwa na find more energy like after training nilikuwa naenda na rest because uki mchezaji akirest more ndio unapata that energy for the next match and for the next training so si poa uki uki train sai then next day uko tao sio unafanya nini <laughs> so ilikuwa na rest so ilikuwa na um, unafa unalala unalala sana na ukilala sana umejua pia ina prepare for the next training na unapata hiyo energy ya game na, na unajua venye mpira euro people without the energy hawezi toboa utakuwa na shangaa ni nini na kwa kiwanja so nilikuwa more focused na nilikuwa passionate kwa kitu nilikuwa nafanya na nilikuwa nachukua rest seriously to to cut those Easy small injuries no na juice pola la vizuri utakuwa unapata hizi more muscle injuries you body yako itakuwa haujarest vizuri na hauna nguvu na pia si poa kwa mchezaji uh, the biggest difference ni tempo ya ball venye mpira inachezwa na venye wachezaji mnaekwa Oh, there is a difference with that but najua mimi nilikuwa najua kona zote za Stockholm na nimeka Sweden sana na nilikuwa najua pia wachezaji wengi huko so it was for more easy for me Yeah I think I find it more comfortable looking at forward because I was playing both left and right so it was advantage kwangu since na use both legs so nilikuwa comfortable na uh, basically mimi right footed so nililan kucheza na left so it's something that we gonna train kwa mdogo ndo nikazoea zoea until nilienda kaka mega ndo akaniweka side ya left huko ah uh, ina depend na pia tactical approach ya coach so na depend pia na game but nikienda right pia is not bad Ah you gonna believe the same but you know anything happens in football so such things happens na hizo ndio vitu zinafanyanga mtu anakuwa strong but you know you unaweza kosa queen hiyo kitu maybe in Sweden ama maybe in Kenya but in future wende ushinde a bigger than that so you just keep on working so mimi nilichukua nilichukulia positive sikuchukulia negative na nili have to focus on the next thing ah my future plans ni maybe to move to more bigger leagues something that we are working on so something that we are still working on in this january na we we'll see what happens So I have played my last season in Sweden because also it depends with the club if the club agrees with the other club that I should go it's well and good so umejua mimi naweza kuwa nimesema ah mimi naenda but the club inaweza sema no 
wana ni old for some time so siwezi move ahead of the club unajua kuna pia inafai kuwa hiyo respect yeah so una move in peace so i just wait to on how the club itakuwa ina interact na other clubs ku for the next move yeah for now wajaniambia but kuna more clubs so is just only the team the club no wanna focus on the final say no most people going to be in france so i'm still waiting yeah i think this is the life that every footballer and a dream of na once you get your opportunity you should never look back in anything because kila mtu anajua background yake na it's never easy for someone to come from africa straight to europe you have to work, work your way up and yeah. it's something that if you have that passion and desire you and dedication as a move so mil kwa na still na wakad though siko najua my fate itakuwa wapi ju i still seek one home to kunishikilia until nili move to other stages nikaonekana ndo nitapata kwa to kunishikilia ju unajua hii ball pia you can never do it alone you see you need to have people around you guide you na wana kushikilia na maana jua Kenya wanafanya pia ah tumi ndo ambia in football world ni agents ndo wana agents ndo wana rule unajua first kama mchezaji una forge package unajua juwezi onekana bila videos unaona there is no point uniambie utex agent muambie bro mimi nataka kwenda europe but agent akiangalia profile picture yako anaona other different things wala <laughs> anaona other different things wewe ukae mchezaji but personal for one to two package to ki media because media also rule wala without that you can't move forward and always yonekana na it's important to kuwa na agent najua most kenyan players wanaogopanga akiwa na agent wana wako na ile tasoli ya sign on fee na wanajua huyu jamaa atakunikulia na pia ukiangalia most agent locally hao wanaangalia anga sign on fee more than welfare mchezaji because at first ukikuwa na contract na mchezaji unako unajua obviously na kuanga 2 years unaona na after hapo pia mnafahamu na kama mtaongeza ama mta mta terminate juu most agent in europe wanaangalia anga welfare yako juu agent anaweza kuletea boots agent anaweza kutrainisha kwambie leo enda huku enda na kupush after game anafaa kuambie leo hapo unicheza hivi na hivi unafaa ku improve because yenda na kuwakia si wewe ndo unawakia agent you at the end of the day ukimeka move yeye pia ata benefit as a person si ule agent anaongojea anasikia gol mai anakutaka acha fika fifth floor <laughs> acha fika fifth floor yana anaongojea tu sign on fee wao rafika wanashindwa eh huyu jamaa alifikaje So majua ina kuwa ni ngumu una tasol tu unaona na hiyo si poa agent anafaa akuangalie kama mchezaji first ajue what your future holds jum mtu mtu anaangalia future yako anajua future yako iko vizuri atakana wewe from day one until ile siku yenye maybe utaenda down na still atakufuz jum mimi nakumbuka nikiumia agent wangu hapo niacha niambie ah sasa umeumia waja ni focus na wachezaji wengine still alikuwa anakuja kuniona tunafanya vitu zingine maybe saa zingine tunaenda tunaenda tunajienjoy kwa mall so it's something that agent ana fast stick na wewe no matter what you are going through kiona ule agent anakuja saa zile kuna kuna deal anataka do that is not a good person so hiyo ndo kitu tunafaa tuangalie sana kwa wachezaji do najua locally kuna few few agent wenye wako recognize na FIFA and that is something that ina to affect our wachezaji unajua mchezaji una text yao naambiwa maybe team flani na kutaka wanatoa 1 million so hiyo 1 million wewe ujui maybe wewe utapata 200k so hiyo 1 million 800k inaenda kwa mtu kwa mtu mwingine so it becomes so difficult 
because at the end of the day you still have to get that money you still have to invest na unajua football pia ni short career ukiwa ni mtu anakukulia una agent anakula more than you then you are in wrong hands Uh, first of all, there are more opportunities locally. Unajua, na it's good to invest back home. Na kuongelea investment, unapo invest sasa hii kama uko juu. Juu football leo uko juu kesho uko chini. So if you don't have something that keeps you going, something that makes you look forward, it will be difficult because you can never depend on football alone. You have to have something that inaku back up kama mchezaji. Unaona? So ukianza ku invest sai usiongoje umalize ball ndio uanze ku invest because unaweza maliza ball then usikie hiyo do pia emergency imetokea hiyo do hiyo uko me una save pia imeenda so umejua inakuwa difficult as the matter una invest pia unafa pia unaeka something for emergency na it's always good pia ku invest pia you need to have some insurance because hiyo ni something important na unafaa tu unakuwa na maybe can you see or maybe kama maybe kama mchezaji uko na familia unapokuwa na educational insurance because i don't think it's much expensive juu kama uko na mtoto hii una save ya mtoto hii juu there is no need like in future unapata mchezaji ana over school fees though something happens na mimi siwezi blame mchezaji there are many things that happens unajua once pesa yako imeisha there will be many questions and people will question who jamali kuanga na pesa pesa yake imeenda but in the background mtu ajui what happened maybe hiyo pesa yako maybe hata ulibiwa maybe hata anything ili happen so mimi siwezi question mtu maybe pia ni lack of knowledge maybe pia ni ignorance maybe pia kuna hiyo class yenye mtu anafundishwa about Maybe mtu wa kwenda business class au kwenda hiyo education concerning the business and anything because you can even start a business with your money but at the end of the day your business can collapse in the next day because if you are not patient with it anything napata biashara yako itanguka tu hivyo so biadua chezaji if you have anything you just start with what you have Uh, first of all me mu learn from people na sometimes i learn from other people's mistakes na say i make mistake any other person will make you you the best thing you can learn from a person who is falling down is just to learn something positive from it because so that you cannot repeat what other people are doing because say i kufanya kenye other people before me walifanya and I kufanya everything in my own way though if you fail you still learn and you still move on and you can never stay in one place you are crying for something that has already happened so you have to think of the next thing so me na learning in environment na napenda kwa kwa environment ya ya something that I, I am learning you napenda nikila nivo ina inspire for the next thing that unifanye so try to repeat the same mistake na period ilikuwa so tough period but at the end of the day bado nilikuwa meyang nilikuwa nasema i still love time ju ala wao mtu alikuwa hapo anacheza hapo nilikuwa nasema indio time yake ya kushine so if indo time yake ku shine it's okay ju pia mimi nilikuwa na you think as a focus on that person na niko na injury ainge kuwa poa una focus na position yako so you kwa more focus on me ku il kwanza kurudi pole pole then nirudi next season ju mimi nilikuwa na target next season si kwa na target the main season ju nakumbuka other director akiniuliza akiniambia sasa hiyo kienda Kenya urudi next season kuja usho your quality nikamwambia haina shida you next season we will all begin the same so hapo ndo nilichukulia advantage you pale Sweden once umepatiwa one game ala gani friendly onyesha that you can play because ukifurahisha mafans 
utakuona cheza juu they see your work everybody else anaona kazi yako ndio pale europe ni rahisi sana kila mtu anaona kazi yako venye unafanya vitu nini nini so ilikuwa na work to behind the scenes ilikuwa ngumu do ilikuwa na some kenyans walikuwa na kwa ni visit so hiyo ndio ilikuwa na keep away to think more negatively but ilikuwa na washukuru sana for everything that they did ilikuwa a more fantastic job jua kuna do is not it is hard to survive in a foreign land kwanza kwa uko na injury na una mse wa kunini unaweza shikwata na depression kwa uko uko peke yako home so inaweza kuwa inaweza kuwa a difficult journey kama una strong mentality ah kitwa kwa mimi nilikuwa nachukulia posti but unajua in national team leo uko na huyu unajua leo uko na huyu hapa ukirudi next day unapata uko na mtu mwingine ukurudi huko leo unapata uko na huyu kijana kwenda kuja huko unapata different people so unapata muna alternate so it becomes so difficult to gauge as a player unaona na we always have those few days na few days can't make a difference unaona nikaa tu wewe ukuje tu kwa exam Uja soma then up 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 kwa exam unataka kupata A. Ona it's so difficult to to manage but at the end of the day you have to play for your country. Wewe ndio pale useme at sasa mimi nimekuwa na nani? Ju sijakuwa nikicheza na yeye aye hivi. So mjua the more mnacheza the more pia mnajuana as players. So if to maintain the same the same players the same the same team it becomes so easy to gel do national team haikwangi haikwangi to command kwa mtu do leo uko hapa kesho huko so it's something that but we must have that consistency yeah that's yeah, my two kwa kwa ni mentality how we take football as a country do football football as a whole is an investment and it's something that it brings joy to everybody in the world and you can see outside outside the world how people want to value football than anything football is the most watched sport in the world now once we take seriously football and invest in kwa upcoming players hawa to your dogo you kiangalia other sweden kila mali kuna kiwanja ukue store ukwe unapiga laptop au unataka ku train unaingia tu kwa any field unaenda hapo una train you wanajua the importance of football you are looking at grao hapo pale ni watu hiyo wanacheza kwanza ukipata hata ni team yetu ya under sg15 wanacheza derby na maybe team hapo ma fans ukuja wanakuwa wengi wana wana support hawa to hii so it's something that fans tunafa to work to produce maybe my fans kwa kiwanja na unajua pia marketing in football is something that it plays a big role na ukiangalia size like maybe unaona ni kama hakuna football Kenya but me na believe everything else it fall in place but unajua pia sasa ningeni tunasema anga itakuwa 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 unapata itakuwa ufike 40 years bado itakuanga tu unaona it can be difficult itakuwa itakuwa we must have some to kuwa na one stand tuseme side kwa serious na ball na iko hivi na hivi na mseme we want to invest in this team na we want to invest in sport na fatuanze hapo na if if we invest in for in sport kila mtu atafurahia na ita bring value as a country na i think it will be the best thing ah jina ni fatu huko kakamega no it's feel pressure no na kila mtu anakuwa na level yake. Ala mimi sasa naanza kupatia jina unaitwa Kafu na no, unacheza <laughs> unacheza Sunday football. <laughs> uh-huh. Wala. So means feeling any pressure because at the end of the day I have to be me. As long as I have the name I still love to be me. I still love to ma- maintain I'm 100% me. As long as kuna kuna role model, you still love to pick what is positive and the negative you leave it. So miss nanga pressure on anything i have to work on myself maybe to reach to the higher level than him so kila mtu akona jani yake na ni different jani 
Naweza nataka kuwa kama huyo then find everything is not going well. So you are just have to be you. No matter even if you have that name. It depends on how good I'm a plan. I've seen maybe in a, on a, maybe top five leagues because kila mtu ana dream na to reach that dream you have to still work. I mean that we too fast. It's only on dictionary, dictionary that success comes before hard work. So as long as we work, we need to find someone who holds your hand. Because me usually kwambi a kijana work 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 work, then you don't have a good father, ana. Because other people when you achieve, wali kwa na good father. Alione kana dia kaienda, ana. Na sometimes una pata gamuto na kwambi a yaje bro, una pona una ni connect na uyu na uyu, but at the end of the day, someone is not packaged, ana. Unjuta, unadi utampati na baadhi. But at the end of the day, ajen kala mungu shia video. Na na ukitu ma video, na pata mdua ukitu ma video na jambo. So much jo. Ona it becomes difficult. Miss wazi tu wazi tu mia team video mdua na jambo. Ona awataki. Iyo wenye si ni ni skills ya kodi wana ngali anga vitu mingi. But at the end of the day, as as a footballer, you have to find something that. Anchors you something that keeps you looking forward as a player, something that makes you dream. Na you have to be passionate because nothing great in this world has been complete without passion. So, and at the end of the day, you should never, you should never let anyone make you feel like you don't deserve what you want. So you have to keep on working. You have to take every opportunity that you get because opportunity comes once in a lifetime. If you get the second chance, then you are lucky. I think before you go to you go to Marcelo, you will go to Angalanga. All the games now, but as time grows, as time goes, you know, na you have to stand for yourself. Na for now, I am my own role model because <laughs> uh, that's a clever answer. Yeah, I am my own role model because at the end of the day, it is between me and God. So. <laughs> Uh, interesting answer. So, so I, I have to, to keep pushing myself and motivating myself. Yeah. Uh, I think when you are in a you are in a receiving state, unafa unafa kuna mentality na positive attitude because because. Okay, you have a poor attitude and you want to succeed, you will never move, move forward because every time you will be thinking negatively about something. You want to step into Europe. You want to step into Europe. You want to step into Europe. You want to step into There is no way that they will leave their own people. Then, when you are a foreigner, you are not doing more enough if you're not performing than their their person, it becomes difficult. Now that's why you are not receive more criticism. Then you end up mentality up in a shut foot down evil. So you can Sweden. You just work. No matter what. Because when you think to Sweden everything shoots up. Now it shoots up at the same time. Now if it shoots up very fast then maybe you are blessed so <laughs> so when you are in life me only god blessings and lessons so there is not maybe maybe you have to continue to, to work to one of the good mentality when you are what you want what you eat how you sleep you i to back a sleeping pattern yako to adapt to that day. So, you probably go foreign land. It's the same as maybe foreign like Kuja Kenya. We demand more for them. Now, come when in Femonia, you can Mali, Mutana demand more for you. You get mad, then you are in the wrong place. Maybe you should just stay home, 
ukunywa maziwa so <laughs> so ukiona mtu ana demand more from you then you have to be positive because pale kila mtu anakupush ni hivi na hivi kenya uzuri ya maswidin like wana penanga mtu ana wakab ukienda do pale uonyeshe wona wakab unakimbia uchoki unafanya hivi na hivi then watakuimba hadi leo siku tadeni Uh, parting short round on the uh, they should continue supporting their own players and uh, they should continue being positive with them there though there is always criticism and uh, no statue has been built in part of criticism every statue maybe as a player in a jengwanga hapo for a positive thing because you have done something great for them you never find someone who has been criticized on the Mjengia statue hapo. So, they should be just positive and we continue moving forward because you may and appreciate your support because without that support, you can never move forward as a player. So, you should be always humble to your fans. You should always be, you just talk to them. You, you, it's not good that you have make it sasa when you wanna the features you leo uko happy, uko nini. Mko na kubotea utaki hata kunini. Just just have, we just have to be humble, interact with your fans, share good ideas because unaona pia ama fans ni watu pia wanaweza kusaidia hapa nje. Maybe unaweza enda umekuwa mahapo kwa bank unapata kuna mtu hapo anakusaidia anakwambia yeye ni nani hivi na hivi. Waje nikusaidie because there is there is life besides football. Na what is important ni najua watu waangaliangi in the field Life I going kwa kiwanja. Life ina kuanga afsa. Umemaliza hiyo ball. Unajua sasa ndo unajuanga life ni ngumu. The same way unamaliza high school. Unajua <laughs> ukishamaliza high school unajua sasa what next with my life? Unaza university. Unajua sasa ndo life ina ku welcome because in school you are just being prepared to do for the next stage. So you just have to interact with the people, talk to them, share life ideas. You kuna watu wako na good opportunities hapa nje just among the fans you siona analipa hiyo 50 bob kuja kuona na ah huyu jamaa ananga do but at the end of the day some, that that person has more greater ideas than you because you just have to share those ideas with the ideas you learn what to what to do in life you without those ideas then it will be difficult you mimi maybe kuna msana anajua Mimi kuna mtaa anajua business business management. Mimi sijui. So nikimuuliza inakuanga aje na aje. Anaweza kuandikia business plan. Anaweza kuandikia anything that you want. Unafaa unajua. So at the end of the day, you just have to be humble as a person. Hata mtu akiona taao unatembea, wewe tembea tu. Ju akunanga tumbaya like you want to live beyond your expectations. Unaona? Just yeah. live with your means. Kama wewe unapata anga hiyo 10k na wewe mchezaji just live your life ju hakuna haja upata hiyo 10k but una bounce kuliko mtu anapata 1 million <laughs> so you just have to live according to your means so for the fans we know ambia tu nda continue tu kwa me proud na everything else will fall into place najua maybe wako na expectation hai kijana anafaa kuwa huku na huku but tunajua hiyo pia tunachanga Mungu Naweza amua mimi nataka kutoka. But club ikisema huyu kijana atoki. Sio yeye ndani kijana na club. Unajua sometimes you have to respect the contract. Na kuna haja create bad blood in your place of work because one day you will also return there. Maybe unaweza enda kwa hiyo next level na ulitoka vibaya. Then ikuchachie. Still you will want to come back. So Ana fatu kujua tu there is always time for everything and when that opportunity comes then we'll not look back we'll continue do if i move to another stage then it's, it is a win for kenyan football it's not a win for me only it's for the fans and for the upcoming footballers so you are many calcium na calcium inasaidia mtupa yako mimi niko na vitu mingi ni vitamin so something that ukiona msa na kula usiona aibu kula unajua Mtu anaonanga eh ni kidoba Kenyan food naonekana pala pala kwa airport. Beba ndio 
Ndio wajue pia wewe umeenda kujini. Juu in a foreign land the food sometimes iwezi ku favor. You have to carry your own food. That's why unapata ngara team zingine zikienda huko wanabeba machefu wao, wanabeba food zao. It's not something that you need to be shy of. You just have to be proud that in your home country you produce something that other countries don't have. So mimi niko proud nayo. So siwezi ona hai at you mimi nakula hii nini na kula hii nini. The same way as mzungu anakula fish. It does that me nabeba ile ndogo. <laughs> yake ni kubwa. <laughs> uh, unabeba ng'a kiasi gani most likely? Na kama sasa next time ukienda una plan kubeba unga ngapi na umeona kilo ngapi? Normally unabeba ng'a kiasi gani? Na mimi nabeba ng'a mingi. Naweza beba hata unga saba juu majua pia uko na gawi anga watu wengine. Ndio uh-huh. mtana kutext ni aje bro. Nilete hii na hii. Unajua ile ukameka huko majua pia iko wangi nini? Mseme maybe ame misugali anataka hii na hii. So mimi uwabebea na Sasa ni maybe na bebe na bebe pia wachezaji wengine. Na wapea anakuja kwa mwana anambia uko na food unaweza chukua tu huko. So it's not mine alone. Ju huko juu mkipatana pia mnasaidiana. Ni same way we wanaanga tu as Africans. They push it each other. So ukiona mchezaji mwenzako huko ako huko ana rada unamsaidia tu juu. Hata kienda more haya level than you. One day atakumbuka eh nilikuwa ngana huyu jamaa. Pia kisahau it's it's well and good it's for his own benefit so ni future yake so ju hakuna haja it doesn't mean that nikituliana wewe bez nikicheza na wewe it doesn't mean that when you succeed you must help me unaona unaweza kuwa na pass na msee but it doesn't mean in future ako guaranteed to what you are going to get so life happens because as you grow maybe you'll find people don't see things the way you see so you find yourself you just find yourself keeping the memories and you move on so in life people move apart but we just go with the memories